Hey guys, welcome to Living Survival. So today I just wanted to talk about the Leatherman Wave and uh, using it as a bush tool. Now this, obviously, Leathermans are a great multi-purpose tool for survival, bug out bags, uh, just an all around great item to have in your kit. Probably my favorite tool that comes on most Leathermans is the saw. And the reason is, is that it makes a tremendous striker for your ferro rod. You get so much control, there's so much surface here, and it's got such a sharp spine on the back that you really get so much control. You can, you know, broadcast sparks like that if you were going to do uh, char cloth or uh, cotton balls or something like that. But you can really get in here and scrape really gently and still throw sparks, which is important if you're going to light up a pile of tinder uh, without making it go all over the place. Now most ferrocium rods come with a striker such as this and they work okay um, but they just don't seem to give you the control that the saw on the Leatherman does where you can really get in there and scrape stuff off. So most Leathermans do come with a saw um, this just happens to be the Leatherman Wave and it's got a great saw on it. Leathermans are also great, you know, for just general bush work. I mean, the knife on it is uh, a 420C, which isn't the best, but uh, it serves as a good blade. You can definitely create uh, shavings with it because it is so thin. It works great for not only shavings, but also for making fine tinder. You can use the back as well, the spine. So you can really do fine work with it as well. And it even works really well on hardwoods. Now there's lots of other uses obviously on a Leatherman as well. You've got a diamond file, you can use that for sharpening if you had to, as well as a coarse file. You do have a serrated blade, which I rarely ever use, but good for cutting cordage. On the inside obviously you have a great uh, 
pair of pliers which is really good for lifting pots out of the fire. Great pair of scissors for fishing. Couple uh, screwdrivers in there. And it's also got a can opener which you could use also use as a mini awl for uh, sewing or something like that. I don't carry mine in a sheath, I carry it on my pocket just like an EDC knife. It's got a nice deep uh, pocket clip that you can get separately. So let's go ahead and uh, see how this strikes. Now again when you're using a ferrocium rod most people sit there and try to get their fire to light just by broadcasting sparks. What you really want to do is get your ferro rod down in there and really try to scrape some of that material off and that's where the that's where the Leatherman saw comes in so handy because it really allows you to get in there and scrape without messing up your whole tinder pile.
So I hope you guys get out there and use your Leatherman. I definitely use it a lot as a bush tool for striking ferro rods and doing some fine work and cutting and all sorts of different things you can do. So if you don't already have a Leatherman, add one to your kit. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Leave me some comments below and subscribe for more videos.